Manchester City have enjoyed one of, or if not the best seasons in their history. They finished the Premier League with 86 points with a good 12-point lead. Often in the previous seasons, City looked really good in the attack, but they would sometimes show their defensive frailties. This was a major concern for City, as they wanted to sign a defender who is really comfortable with the ball and is solid defensively as well, to fit Pep's style of play. Welcome back to the channel guys. Today we will be looking into the past and journey of the Portuguese star, Ruben Dias, who has established himself as one of the best defenders in the world. Without any further ado, let's get started. Ruben Dias was officially announced as a City player on 29 September 2020. Manchester City have reportedly signed him on a six-year deal and paid about 60 to 70 million euros to obtain the services of the Portuguese maestro. Ruben Dias or Ruby, as they call him, was born on 14 May 1997 in the city of Amadora of Portugal. Ruben had an interest in football from a very young age as he used to play football in the corridors of his house. At the age of nine, Ruben was taken to CF Estrela Amadora, the local football team's academy. Initially, he was deployed as a striker in 2006. Two years later, Ruben's parents took him for a trial at the Benfica Academy, and the trial went really well. Once he joined the academy officially, the new coach asked him to play in the midfield, as Ruben didn't yet have the height and the physicality of a defender. But this wouldn't last long, as when Ruben's growth spurt hit, he was told to play as a center back. This new change was a life-changing move for the little Ruben. He started progressing rapidly through the youth ranks. Alongside being a brilliant defender, Ruben had leadership skills. He captained all the youth ranks he went through, and he would often be the coach's voice on the pitch and in the dressing room. Ruben Dias made his debut with Benfica B in the year 2015. He helped Benfica B finish in the fourth place. He also was called up for the Portugal youth team, and he lead his country to the UEFA Youth League finals in the 2016-17 season. He was promoted to the first team of Benfica in the year 2016, and he helped the Eagles clinch the 2018-19 league title. As Ruben played as a striker and as a midfielder in his youth days, he was really comfortable with the ball despite his height and physique. He also won the Portuguese league's best defender. Many clubs wanted to get hold of him, but eventually, Pep City convinced Ruben to join them. He has replaced the gaping hole left by Vincent Company and is one for the future. Ruben Dias has been rock solid this season. With 15 clean sheets in 32 appearances in the Premier League, the Portuguese maestro has established himself as one of the best defenders. With him and John Stones forming a rock-solid defense, City have won the Carabao Cup and the Premier League. As of now, he helped City reach the Champions League final for the first time in the club's history. Ruben Dias would most likely continue to be the spine of City for a long time to help them win many titles. If you guys have enjoyed the video, a like and sub would be appreciated. You can comment your opinion in the comment section as I'll try to respond to each and every comment and opinion that you guys have. See you in the next video. Until then, ciao.